Hello, Peter Detmer, Madison College. Uh, we just downloaded uh, this project file and had added the configuration files for the device net and control net. Now that the file was loaded, we see that there are some warnings on some of these items. So we will demonstrate how you can fix this. Uh, this uh, these yellow exclamation marks mean there's something not working in these units. Since it's all of the items after this control net card, it is very likely that the control net has not been scheduled. In order to do so, we're going to go into program mode, then right click on slot 5, the CNET card, go to properties, go to RS networks, we're going to click the schedule control net button and click the launch RS networks for control net. This will automatically open the installed version of RS Networks for Control Net. We have version 11. Um, this will prompt you there's a mismatch, so which is why we have those errors. So it's going to download the file and from configurations from the uh, Control Net card. Okay, so now all the uh, information has been downloaded from the control net card. Uh, there's a diagnostics option that we can run. We want to click edits enabled. Then we'll run the start. It's going to go through and look at each individual item in the rack. Look at all the control net devices. Now that this has all been checked out, we can go to network and say download to network. This will update the control net keeper file and schedule the control net so that all items will schedule and run and communicate. So the download has completed. You can see down here in the message codes that uh, these devices have been updated. The address configuration now matches. And uh, to verify, we can simply close RS networks. Click OK in RSLogix 5000. Go back into run mode. But you can see that all of these yellow exclamation marks are now gone. IO is OK and we're good to go. Thank you for your time.